Good evening guys, this is my vlog. I didn't do the Christmas vlog because I was so busy. Well, kind of busy in kind of other ways doing other stuff. And yeah, it's freaking night time. It's 523. Don't feel like night, but hey, that's the change of time passes and it becomes night. And it's fucking cold in my apartment. Uh, okay. You're gonna say like, why are you wearing a t-shirt if it's cold in your apartment? I don't have many long sleeve shirts. I have vests, which I constantly wear, but after a while I get super hot. This is like the battle of the climate. Uh, and yeah, so seriously, and I feel like I look really tired. Like, I look at myself in the camera right now and I, I'm just like, I look super tired of like zombie and like brains. But like, you know me, I'm a vampire supposedly, so I need my blood, so. I mean, I think that's like my energy boost or my caffeine, if that was it. <laughs> and when I, when I don't feel like I get enough sleep, or I don't know, I get enough sleep, but I just still feel really out of it, I'm going to act like really weird and crazy. It all depends. <laughs> but uh, yeah, um, the one thing I did get for Christmas, not everyone saw this, but it is this really, really high chair. Because I used to have a lazy boy chair sofa chair and it got pretty much uh, thrown away in the garbage when I moved here and that was like back where I used to live and it really sucked and I hated it and I was pretty mad at the people responsible for that because we couldn't bring all the stuff we could have uh, needed or still could have been used like some furniture and slightly some furniture and like some other particular things but not too much because we we're trying to get rid of stuff but as you see in the background we got all these games but we got stuff here which you see only a bit and then we got stuff around here which maybe I should do a video and then you'll understand what I'm talking about but at my other place my stuff used to be more organized and I'm looking for a way to reorganize all of this again but I'm not sure if I'm going to stay in this apartment. Like I said, I have a landlord. And this landlord is, uh, he's, a, he's a really greedy guy. Like, constant times I have uh, me, my roommate, my boyfriend have called to, called or email, write, whatever, to get stuff fixed. The only thing that was like slightly fixed is they did some patching up where there was holes from the previous tenants uh, who were like here with their, their little family and yeah, and it started to make cracks through the wall a bit where they patched it up because of the poor circulation and other stuff. But of all the things I could say, that a lot of shit needs to be fixed, renovated, clean to the max. It, it's, yeah, it's not, it hasn't been done. The, uh, the heat system, there's no thermostat, so it gets really, really cold. And, yeah, basically, freeze my ass most of the time. I have to put, like, sweaters and vests, and, yeah. So, yeah, I really, really don't like it. And it kind of sucks when I'm trying to edit to freeze my ass off or other things in particular. So there's like so many problems with this apartment. So we're at the point right now that we're going to set, we've been trying to do things the le legal way uh, instead of like quickly breaking the buy and having to find someone. 
So, you know, and right now we're at the point where after the holidays we're going to send a letter again, but he has to sign and send it back to us to notify that he read it or he got it. And if he doesn't make the changes or if he doesn't do that, well, then we could go to the authorities on this and they'll take withhold the money of the rent. And if he still doesn't do all which is needed and stuff like that, well, then we are finally legit entitled to, like, you know, go, uh, go move in another apartment, which there's a pretty nice apartment on the other side of the street. Almost the same size or something like that, but it, it, maybe it's the same price or be less, depending. And it looks way more prettier, like how it's like built and laid out and like in renovation. Like this place, I don't mind the size too much, but usually five and a half are like practically you could have in this case this was supposed to be a dining room but five and a halves are usually you could have some five and a halves that are more built like a loft and then you'll have five and a halves that are kind of you know have a dining room and all that instead of like three bedroom and yeah stuff like that I would probably prefer like a five and a half like three rooms because then all my stuff here, the collection and my equipment, would have been like the room for you know, like at my big, at my four and a half when it was just me and my boyfriend, where uh, I would do my videos, collection, and people sleep over and stuff, and it would be like the, the you know, the the chillax room, but also the professional little studio room and stuff like that and uh, it's kind of hard sometimes to do videos super late because I have to be in mind of like volume and other things and if I had my own room of this if there was no bar here uh, and it was closed up with the soundproof stuff on the wall it would help and I could be like loud as much as possible in some sort of way so yeah but um, in a way I'm kind of hoping we can move because I just don't find it's worth the rent money that's being put into here and yeah, I just wanna I want a place where I'm comfortable, not freezing my ass off and happy and that looks clean and proper and then the rest is just up to me and my boyfriend uh, to just buy the furniture some new furniture or maybe some secondhand furniture that still looks like maybe fairly new but not like you know, like really abandoned old furniture. <laughs> um but yeah, you know, like really try to organize uh this all again, maybe get another glass cabinet, some couple bookcases, uh, bins, and organize our CDs and games and stuff like that because it's just sad, seriously. Um, uh, pretty much I wanted to say, but it's kind of like late, but Merry Christmas to three particular communities on Facebook because that's where I go. And it is the gaming YouTube, Facebook gaming community that is held by Dan, Van Dam, or Dan Field Dam, whatever, Danny. And yeah, so I want to thank for the wonderful year that I've been invested or more into that community. It's been cool. I've met some nice people along the way including Dan and I met my other friend Michael and I met some other few other people that I actually became friends with and communicate some with a regular basis some once in a while and yeah and it's when I can I try because I'm, I'm part of so many communities but so many communities stand for different things some are just more like you share your material others like you really invest in forms and talk so I would say the communities that I'm invest invested in is like YouTube gaming community and then it's like also uh, Another community I recently joined, which I want to say, yeah, uh, they're really awesome. They share between modern to retro gaming, and yeah, I can't really go check because I'm having like brain fart right now. Like, damn, Christina, why do you have brain farts? I was like, ugh, I'm so sleepy. I, I like eat and drink. I'm like, I need a power boost. I don't know if I should like make coffee or tea. I'm like, ugh.
French vanilla coffee would be good. I don't have it here. And I don't drink coffee often, but it's probably be a good idea right now. But anyway. Uh, but yeah, I want to thank the other community I recently joined a few months ago, or not too long ago. They're really cool. They talk about retro to modern gaming, from all kinds of systems to PC, classics and stuff, which I'm really into and I feel very welcome into that community and talking to particular people sometimes, or people just generally messaging me, which is nice. And what else? Um, there was other people I wanted to thank for. Uh, there was a... Uh, because, I don't know, like, I, I try to mingle with people when I can. And when I show enthusiasm, people are like, Oh my god, you want to become friends so quick? Like, if they want, you know, become friends with you, they'll let you know. <laughs> and I'm like, but it's not... It's like so rare I get these occasions. Like, sometimes you'll meet someone who really shares the same, a lot of the same stuff with you, or particular, like I said, female gamers. Um, I find it's hard to come by, depending on nowadays how female gamers are looked upon, and how they're represented, and some of them, how some of them act, and stuff, so. Ah, so yeah. Just stretch. It's cautious, because the ninjas, the ninjas. <laughs> but yeah. I'm, um, I was supposed to get a haircut, but I have, like, long hair. It's just freaking clipped right now. It's messy. And, yeah, I, I just, yeah, you know. So, anyways, the other particular people I'd love to say thank you for welcoming in, uh, a part of the group is my friends from Beer and Video Games. They are really awesome. Um, they do... I talk about them quite a few times, <laughs> but uh, they live stream twice a week. I think it's going to still go on for the new year schedule, but on like Wednesdays and Thursdays, they would live stream. So yeah, basically I'll generally I'll just go quickly through that, is that they, uh, they do live streams, and on Wednesdays, they do a particular game that they'll play in the long run, like a long let's play. And then on Thursdays, they do like a certain game every week. And sometimes they have people over or them. But usually, generally lately, they've been having like special guesses. And they play that game and then they pick a beer. And they talk about that beer and they talk about the theory of the beer. And they rate it. And all that stuff, and then they try to, yeah, like, they try to find a beer that kind of goes with the game they're playing, and then they have fun, joke around, play games, have fun. And, uh, what I do is I am one of the two, uh, I'm out of the three mods, I am one of them. Then there's, uh, Wado and Spooky Ducky, which is Bill. And yeah, we mod and we just make sure everyone's intact, give information talk to people, all that stuff, so I really like that. And since I have the time on my hands, uh, I do that, basically. Even if I didn't have the, like, even if I, like, you know, I wasn't that available, I think I would still try to be available for it, like, for a bit and then go to sleep if I was working the next day. But it would depend on my schedule. I don't know, I'm not much of a morning person. So it's like, grr, and more of a night being, like sometimes I'm okay in the morning, but it really depends on what time, and I don't know, it's just, you don't want to be next to me in the morning sometimes. Like this morning I was woke up pretty early, I wasn't really upset, <laughs> I was just like annoyed because everything was trying to make noise and come in the room so many times cat boyfriend and I wanted to sleep and I didn't get mad but I got slightly annoyed I'm like no one wants to grab me in my sleep so yeah but uh, if not there was there's there's times I'm just not quite a morning person and if I had to work at night or overall with like YouTubers do, they tend to work throughout the day or night. I don't really care because I'm like, whether it's a job like that at home or something else, it's, I'm well suited for that. Anyway, so yeah, 
what else do I want to say? So yeah, they've been really awesome. They give me, they talk about my channel. I talk about them. Uh, we talk about stuff, communication. Really nice people. I always feel truly loved and welcome with uh, all the people from Beer and Video Games, which is Bear and Jack, and the other people I mentioned. Also, I will be trying to. I think I'll keep the other stuff for more later on, but as Christmas gifts I got, for now, because I don't know if I'm getting any other gifts late later on, but I got this turtleneck, which is a brown-orange turtleneck, I'm sure it's like inside out right now, but it's a pretty, pretty nice, like, it's very cozy, it's very soft, um, like, Depending on the wow factor is that, okay, I had a bigger reaction to this because I really, really wanted it badly. And this, I still like it, but I didn't have as big of a wow factor. And, and I don't know if that's a meaning I don't like it and stuff like that or I hate it. I actually like it. It's just obviously sometimes there will be particular things that you'll want or think you'll get, you'll get a depending on reaction, but I still appreciate it from my boyfriend. So my boyfriend got me this, got me the chair. Um, I didn't expect him to get me like clothes, but like, cause I kind of needed, I think I'm going to have to get rid of other vests, but he got me like this kind of hoodie vest. Which I don't really most of the time go for like stuff with the writing, but I actually like it. It's really comfortable. I might have to get rid of some old ones, give some to the poor, like donate clothes to the poor. And I really like it, it's very comfy, so like keep me nice and warm. And we got, I got games because I don't freaking get games as much anymore and it's sad unless it's Steam or Humble Bundle once in Blue Moon, but it's very rare due to my situation financial reasons and other stuff that I won't get into right now but my friend got me this I am so happy because I really wanted it and it has the same music from uh, Nier if I'm pronouncing it right and yeah I'm so happy because now I just gotta get number one and two because I used to play one and two on the PS2 so I'm so happy I'll be able to get the other two eventually down the line and yeah, this beautiful game because I love like very dark stories and this has an intriguing storyline and character but oh my god the soundtrack and my boyfriend got this but these are kind of like the games we get is basically this he got Bravely Default which are the games that kind of keep investing so like whatever I have I share with him whatever he has he shares with me like I'll say for sure I am interested in playing this big time so this is to like this is like well we'll both play it and if he wants to play this we'll be able to play it if he wants to but this game is awesome uh, if everyone down the line and when I have money, I'll buy myself a separate copy, but if not for now, uh, I'll play it when he's not playing it, and yeah, so, but this is game, it's cool, can't wait for the second one to come, but it's a kind of cool game that, you know, to play together, and when I have enough money, I'll buy myself a separate copy, but for now, we'll, we'll just share this, and it's really cool, got that. So I got, I got those things, I got the chair, and I got a really awesome thing, is that I'll do a review on this program, because I have like programs, and I should cut this, make this video short soon, because I've been talking for quite a bit, is that I have things like FFsplit, but it doesn't always work that good, so I use mostly between OBS and Fraps. And recently, I've been wanting a program badly enough, and it was called Action, and it was it's on sale right now, and it's thirty three percent to f or forty percent off on Steam or on the website, and there is a difference in between usage. So there was commercial use, and then there was um, 
home use and then there's some other really cool programs in the future that I want to check out if I really need or would like whether it's on there or other particular programs on other sites or something like that uh, and yeah this uh, yesterday I just talked to my my uh, my dear special friend or he's just someone special individually and he he gave it he bought it for me and I wasn't expecting that and I'm like oh my god and he's like think of it as a donation to your channel to make even more awesome make your channel even more awesome and you can make more awesome videos so I'm like oh my god was like oh my god I'm like do the big eye look um and it was like I had like tears of joy and like tears of joy <laughs> but uh I was so happy, and same time I was just talking about all kinds of stuff I don't really need to get into, but it was like video games and other particular things. But just you know, um, you know other things. I'll probably fill you in more on another video, but I will be reviewing that program soon, so stay tuned for that. Uh, I do have a busy week ahead of me, so if I don't make videos more frequent like I did the past for a while now, it's because this week I have so many parties to go to, but maybe I could film something at my gamer party I'm supposed to go to and uh, some other stuff along the way if I have a chance. So I'll try my best to post up some other videos soon. and. Yeah, I just want to say also that I'm thankful for the Montreal gaming community. I'm sadly haven't been able to go to events lately because due to money financially or uh, the timing and stuff and other things. But hopefully one day I will go to an event and I would like to collaborate with other people at one point. Whether it's gaming or anime or something else, just overall, I want to be a part of podcasts, and I want to maybe do podcasting. Mm, for the live streaming, I gotta say I'm having a little significant problems. I might need to buy a new router or something because lately, uh, since winter came, the internet's been acting up, and the router I think here is pretty old. So I think I need to upgrade, and then I could live stream again but more stable so it won't be like having really bad connection but uh, I don't know most of the time my internet's not always a bitch but lately it's been like so 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 anyways peace love and hugs and I hope you guys all have a happy new year because Christmas is over and I was almost gonna say Christmas but I kinda wish my Christmas would have gone better it was kind of like so-so, but I could always share that another time. It was, or I can share it now very quick because whatever. I don't know when I'll have it next time. Is that it was just pretty on the sell side. I didn't get to see family really that much. Um, it was dull. Friends came a little late to like dinner yesterday. We had fun, watched a movie, ate dinner, and yeah, and then. Today, uh, the day before that on Christmas Eve, well, I had some Lebanese food and chill with my boyfriend, watch the movie, drink some Christmas beer, which I really love Christmas beer. It's like, oh my god, it was so good. But besides, that, not much is going on, and I felt like something was missing. And at least for my friends online and for the people who really care about me online and in person, so I don't see that that much in person. Uh, I find, depending on the people, it wish me Merry Christmas and other stuff, so I was touched. But yeah, I'm gonna cut this down. It's 23 minutes, I think it's uh, good enough, so see ya. Peace.